Welcome to the first live episode of FFP. My name is Paul and I am, as always, your host. And we are recording on the 31st of January 2018. And I welcome to the stage the Alpha Comic of Vienna, the man who stood against the water bottle and said, no more, it is Jack Holmes! <laughs> Woo! Hey, hey Jack, thanks for being here. Yeah, wait, uh, yeah, yeah, you should use your mic voice, man, you know? <laughs> Well, for putting down the beer, that was really important that they heard yes, that. Yes, yes. Uh, <laughs> sorry, sorry, guys. Sorry to the listeners <laughs> that are not here right now. Yes, thank you for doing that. No problem. <laughs> and we are already at the first segment, guys. It is... Top performance. I, yeah. That is the dumbest thing I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> Wait, we are already... That is the dumbest thing I've ever seen in my life and I just sat through 50 minutes of that movie. <laughs> it's actually, actually, in this case, we are already at the secret category and it is... Jack still hates Paul. <laughs> so you still hate me and the work that I do. I love that. <laughs> that took as much effort as me sitting down on stage. <laughs> <laughs> to get the Jack says something mean to Paul. <laughs> I love you too, man. I w two would imply I said it first. <laughs> <laughs> you, yeah, okay, fair enough. <laughs> yes, it's it's been it's been well one-sided love. Oh, you have a dick on your notes yeah, as well. The, the first thing I did on my notes was drew a what I think is a pretty triumphant-looking penis. That's a pretty good <laughs> dick. That's a pretty good. Di yeah, applause to the dick. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. It's been a while since I had an applause break on stage. That makes me feel better about yeah. myself. <laughs> so, man, uh, we are in top performance mode. Yeah. Well, we are technically in Jack still hates Paul mode, but technically, what, what do you want to start with? Or is one interweaved with the other? What's, uh, what's your top perform performance first? Let's, um, let's, let's start with that. I don't know. It was, they, they, it was all terrible it's, it's, hard to, it, it's hard to pick a performance that sucked less than any of the others but so you didn't like a, any of them well like i i especially you hate didn't like the cat who got stepped on and still performed after that no because they spent so much time trying to like oh look here's an actual cat because here's this person who's does not know how to hold or put down a cat, <laughs> by the way. Oh, no, and he's then, very inept at handling and pussy. Then it, then we see that through the whole movie. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was terrible. <laughs> Can we get a Ben soundbite for that machine? <laughs> oh, that was terrible. <laughs> <laughs> next episode, next live, <laughs> next live show. Ben is going to make it on the no, sound part. So I, I didn't get the fucking old man who was like, scaling a desert in what I yes. assume was the Middle East who looked like he had fried chicken skin attached to his <laughs> neck. <laughs> he looked like straight up he was after a nuclear yeah. uh, uh, fallout hit him and, and he has very bad cancer. Ju yes. Judging from fucking, what was it, uh, Bruno the Brutalizer or whatever the fuck yeah. guys, they had the budget to get old men in the movie. Why did they hire a 12-year-old boy and say, <laughs> speak like an old man? <laughs> well... Um, and also, what? Who the fuck leaves a fucking chest full of maroon? Oh yeah, that was in the <laughs> middle of a desert. That was very easy to find. That was that was scary easy to find. Was that, that even what they were looking for? I have no idea. I yeah. think the I think the granddad just roams the earth I, to not go back to that grandmother. Here's why. I, here's why I'm mad. I at think you. he's just he's really like. I don't want to go back to Austria. I don't want to hang out with my wife anymore. She's a horrible, horrible human being who apparently her diet consists of bread, butter, and sausage, which, yeah, I, I mean, that's a very Austrian diet yeah, if, you, that, if I, you think about it. But I, I, From the eight years I've lived in Austria, that's what I would assume you all eat. <laughs> <laughs> the worst May, maybe swap the fucking butter for grandma schmaltz and then it's... <laughs> No, 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 that would have been disgusting. No, oh, no, yeah. <laughs> no, the, the worst thing is I've got such sandwiches a, as a child. Not from my parents because they loved me. From your grandmother. Yeah, but <laughs> from, from other relatives who were like, I don't, I don't love you, kid. Here, have a s normal sausage and butter sandwich. Yeah. It is the most blandest and unhealthy food item on the planet. Yeah, the, 
it was not a thing. That that entire sandwich, all of its ingredients were originally wrapped in plastic. Oh fucking! <laughs> <laughs> it's yeah. just this fucking server plastic after a certain. I point. mean, I mean, her life is not worth anything anyway, anymore. But anyway, but here's so. here's why I hate you because. <laughs> Because yes. of the, uh, the amount of wank movies you have made me sit through <laughs> in the name of this fucking ridiculous podcast. And the first actually genuinely enjoyable for the right reasons movie that you is the one that I now have to shit on in public. <laughs> And it's like, yeah, let's try and pick this movie apart. There's no point. It was supposed to be bad. And oh, yeah, yeah. No, no. We all got that, yeah. I think. We all got that it was supposed to be bad. But there's there's, there's no reason why we can't have a good time with it, you I, know? I, yeah. No, that's, that's <laughs> not in your normal experience, that's not in my, in my vernacular, but we'll, we'll okay. try it anyway. <laughs> all right. Um, there, there, there have been... I mean, the the cat was again a pretty good performer. Um, like he he was. What? Wait, 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 was wait, wait. mishandled at the beginning. Okay, very well, severely. All right, so th- all right, there's things I want to get off. Uh, clearly, yes. uh, Herman is inbred. Either his. <laughs> You I also mean I, a regular his, Austrian. Either his grandma or his grandpa was also his brother or sister, clearly. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't mean, know how that I mean, there's a reason, I think, why the, the grandpa was played by the same actor. Oh, was the, oh, it was the yeah, same yeah. actor? Okay. Yeah, that was the same I actor. I think nearly every male in that. I, I'm sure the free-titted gypsy woman was also played by the same <laughs> actor. <laughs> <laughs> Only th- the one boob. No, no. <laughs> No, but clearly, like, because that... He was a real tit while filming those scenes. I am going to smack you over the head with the mic. (laughs) If you make one more fucking pun like that when I sat here. (laughs) I'll do it in front of the people on camera as well. I'll show (laughs) my driving (laughs) license so there is evidence of the crime and then I'll beat you to death. I mean... And no Austrian judge in the world would blame me. An Austrian judge would probably send you free after... The, he did what at the beginning? He made what kind of pun? Oh, yeah, yeah you, can, you can go. Yeah. That's, yeah, that's basically what okay, happen, will so, happen. Uh, yeah, clearly Herman's inbred, yeah. bread, mm-hmm. uh, which is why I assume he has so much trouble holding a cat <laughs> and why he was so proud to have a chestnut stand on his side street that literally no one but his grandma and apparently the really inexplicably the attractive women walk down. Yeah, the really f- the really fucked up thing here is is that nobody from the zoning uh, commission came by to stop this illegal business <laughs> and shut it down immediately. <laughs> We're in Austria. This was the most... That is the most Austrian <laughs> fucking thing I have ever heard. 50 <laughs> minutes of that... Ab- Abortion on a screen and the most awesome it did you they, they the zoning permission didn't come by and that's what your biggest fucking hang up was not it's some fucking <laughs> inbred fucking mongoloid going around decapitating fat people with a show snuffle no it's that the fucking zoning permission didn't show up to shut down his chestnut stand six seconds after he showed up actually well now that you say that Actually, it would have been more the health and safety board that would have stopped by. <laughs> because that, that oven was not secured properly. And that was a wooden shed that in combination is a fire hazard of only waiting to happen. Well, it's a fire hazard. It already happened as a hazard. But, you know, transforming into an actual fire, you know, it's it. That, 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 that okay, yeah, please, <laughs> please. No, 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 no. You dig yourself out of this wanker. <laughs> no, not really. I, I, I don't have I don't feel like it yeah. right now. Um okay, so I got I got a note for fat guy. <laughs> um yeah, okay, so fat guy yeah. sees uh that uh Oh he was a uh, really that inbred good actor. fucking Austrian leather face has just <laughs> decapitated his friend uh-huh. with a show snubble yes. and he's like, I'ma go after this <laughs> with my really weak flimsy <laughs> chain and but show this guy who's boss. He 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 hits the, the speed at that chain that it whips. Have you ever heard of whipping chain? No, but I've also never heard of someone getting magical fucking yeah, Arab chestnuts enough. that give you the power to go around slaughtering people with a show snuffle. That's, that's so fair. I've had to suspend my sense of disbelief a mm, lot for this. Yeah, I, I, I can see that. I can see that. Yes. Uh, anything else? Any um, okay. Best? Uh, yeah, Hannah, who the fuck orders five chestnuts? <laughs> yes. Who she, the fuck walks I mean, around? 
A, if, even if that's all you can have, then which I mean, you're not hungry, don't I mean, order chestnuts. I mean, I think it's it, it's it trying to imply that they both have mental problems. I don't think it is, because she looks really normal. And they are each other. Huh? She looks really normal. Oh, which <laughs> leads me on to another thing. Why? <laughs> Why yeah. is it every movie you make me watch for this podcast has, has a rape scene yeah. in it? Yeah, I'm sorry. I is it sorry. just because <laughs> fucking every goddamn movie you make me watch has a rape scene? In it. I'm honestly at this point starting to believe it's just every Austrian movie has a rape scene. I in think it. so too. At this point, I think way so too. too enthusiastic on that. <laughs> For a dude with, like, for the listeners at home, yeah. looks quite a lot like a rapist. <laughs> <laughs> you mean the stereotype of a rapist? We yeah, don't know sure. what rapists look like. No, we do him. <laughs> <laughs> Give him an eye patch and an old man beard. Oh, yeah, him <laughs> fucking running to the hills. I mean, was that what was he trying to to channel uh, um, a Solid Snake from from the Metal Gear Solid games? Or I I I don't know what Solid Snake is. I don't know what Metal Metal Gear Solid is. <laughs> <laughs> the two nerds in the audience are like. Whoa. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Live FFPO podcast. Two nerds in the audience. <laughs> I'm sure, just two. <laughs> no, friend, I'm very, I'm very grateful that all of you are here, but you all are wasting your life. <laughs> <laughs> this well, is the last ditch effort of me having a career. And you're <laughs> going on to an Austrian podcast about movies. <laughs> that was your last ditch effort. Yeah, that doesn't imply I was excited about it. It was just like, oh, fuck. <laughs> I did. Oh, begrudgingly last yes. step. Okay, fair enough. All, All right, right, what else have I got? Uh, yeah, Gypsy Lady. So much unnecessary <laughs> dancing. <laughs> She did I mean, not need to be there. That did not I mean, her dancing was quite fabulous. It, I mean, it was, but I love that they just found it in the budget, which clearly was, there was not a lot of budget for this production. No. <laughs> they were like, hey, can we get a free lady? Uh, can we get a third tit on a gypsy woman with a beard? And uh, yeah, that, 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 does it affect effects. the plot at all? Not a little bit. Yeah, <laughs> fuck it. Go with it then. I mean, there, there's, there, there's the argument to be made that not, not anything really except for chestnuts and a shovel make a real impact on the story here. And is there any sort of symbolism between chestnuts and bulls? Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. It's like he got his fucking chestnuts. Yeah, That's exactly. He got his nuts back and he, he nutted up and yeah. I don't want to take any more puns away from from from, from Tamash in the in the fu <laughs> in the future segment. But um, I think we can we can bring somebody you that will morally support you onto this stage. Um, we or, can't or, or is you haven't even asked me who my top performance was yet. Also, that was just a list. No, these, uh, yeah, these were a list of Oh, I thought I you were going list. through best to worst. No, no, no. I was oh, just... Oh, okay. Yeah, then please uh, continue. Uh, uh, best one definitely goes to grandma. Oh, yeah. Because she was... Or, or, alternatively, the director who did not kill himself before production finished. <laughs> <laughs> Audience reaction is dictated. goes to the director who did not kill himself. Mm -hmm. yeah, 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 yeah. No, he he must have had some really good psychotherapist. I think that. Uh, or yes, he needs a really good psychotherapist. <laughs> yeah, it's, you know, potato, potato in Austria. Um, any anybody else? Um, I'm still mad that Hannah only ordered five chestnuts. I don't <laughs> think that's something. <laughs> As You're a really hung up on those as nuts. As a fat person, I really don't. Oh see yeah, yeah. You should always order the 12. No, but it's more the fact, all right, okay, if, you're only, if you can only eat five, don't order chestnuts. Just wait until you can eat 12 or however many. Or have a but boyfriend it's, and it's share. The, it's the audacity of her to think that she can just go around disregarding <laughs> whatever Herman has set out as oh, a portion. Yes. Like, he's got <laughs> fucking brackets to make. And he's like, I'll just have five. I mean, at And this that fucking pussy-witten motherfucker who hasn't ever seen a vagina other than his grandma slash cousins is now just like, yeah, fuck it, you can have five. <laughs> I mean, at this point, I think the market dictates the prices because what market? The, exactly, there is none. <laughs> There's one person that she dic dictates whatever, whatever he can sell because she, I think he's he's only excited about his first sell. You know? point, right. I mean, he he would take two and a half chestnuts probably too from her. 
I also want to give it up for the Austrian guy at the beginning who was following around the eccentric millionaire granddad. <laughs> who, uh, who, like, they clearly... You mean, you mean they the clearly, ethnic hire? It was like, how, how close can we make this guy look to an Arab without putting him in blackface? <laughs> <laughs> So Very that close, guy. apparently. Yeah. Yeah. There were moments like, is he a... <laughs> <laughs> he says Effendi more than more at once. Isn't Effendi a name? Because I used to go no, to a Effendi shop called Effendi. No, Effendi means master, I think, or... Sir. Sir, yes. Ah, okay. Yeah, see? <laughs> One Muslim in the audience. <laughs> what? How the fuck do I... <laughs> 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 yeah, you... Yeah. <laughs> no, but it's an Austrian who knows yes. the term for master, though. So there we go. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fair enough. You know, we, we, we uh, which, as a British person, is a joke I have every right to make. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't like that they fucking dressed old chicken skin neck up as an English person either. I noticed that as well. I think that no, that was classic fucking with the white socks and the oh, white yeah, shoes yeah. just yeah. exploring through the desert like come slave boy this is my gonna go, go dirty immediately but yeah. I'm still insisting no, he, on wearing white. They dressed him like an Englishman. Oh yeah, I, okay, I picked yeah. up on that. Yeah, he I mean I mean he he Austrian it up though. Like Speech pattern wise and everything. Well, yeah, it was an Austrian movie. He had to speak. Dude, that <laughs> guy's name was Fritz in real life. Like, of course he Austrian. <laughs> <up. laughs> All right. Um, so you're, you're going for the grandmother? No, I'm going to go for the director who didn't kill himself. <laughs> <laughs> unless, Excellent. Unless the director is a special guest. <laughs> Um, <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, it is. <laughs> the thing is, I've got so many more mean things to say <laughs> until he walks on stage and then I fucking buckle like a coward because this guy makes movies and I'm desperate for a career. It's like, I thought it was really bold what you did there. Oh, no. no, that okay. So I'm, 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 I'm going for the cat because that cat again got stepped on. Wait, are you? Changing my decision for me? Or no, you no, I'm, oh, okay. I'm, ch I'm choosing something too. Oh, I, ch I have the right to choose too. Ah, okay, Jack. that's fine. Right, so go for the cat. Yeah. yeah, yeah, it goes for the cat because that stepping on sequence and then still being able to come on on camera and do a shoot every day that that, that that's real, real. That's real, just real. <laughs> you know. <laughs> you you ran out of words. Didn't yes, you? I I just <laughs> ran out of words officially. So. Let's go to the next segment, uh, but first, a round of applause for the fabulous Monica Ben! <laughs> All right, and your segment is... Best Moment. Nice. Hello. <laughs> hey, Monica. Hello. Hello. How's it going? Amazing. I am yes. so excited to have the <laughs> honor yes. to watch this amazing mm -hmm. masterpiece it, it of Austrian masterpiece. cinema with all of your people. Yes. And with you. It's oh, it was amazing. It was like just <laughs> hold my pen. So what was your <laughs> what was your best moment? What was oh. Because there were some great moments in this Dude, one. Dude, like I consider the entire movie the best moment of my <laughs> life. Like it was it was a very short movie. Like I want more of this. I want the UFO sequel. Oh, <laughs> oh that oh that must yes, yes. Oh. I want to see that too it, that actually. That was the best sequel yes. of all sequels. Like I, I mean, this needs I mean to it's happen. It's interesting enough not the first time that an Austrian movie ends by aliens abducting somebody. <laughs> yeah, big, uh, That's but, a thing. but this time they made it at least in, into a movie that, that, that deserves it. It totally it deserves, deserves it. It deserves to be a YouTube series, a Netflix yes. series. Like, I would watch four seasons of that. <laughs> this, oh. this movie got away with what the fourth Indiana Jones film did not. That's <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it, they even have the white guy who steals foreign land's treasures. I mean... The old guy at the beginning, yeah. the chestnuts belong to somebody. Oh, oh my They're god. They're magic chestnuts, you know? Oh that's my god, it's an ancient relic. Yes, exactly. Oh. Chestnuts for some reason. But mm. yes, still, they, I These mean, they, they have to belong to some Raja or somebody who's it's in a, important in charge and just lost it. It's a tale of a journey of 
how the nuts get passed from his grandfather who, who already had his own proper adventure yeah. to who his grandchild his who, ne yeah. who has yet to find uh -huh. his nuts. It's an yes. incest film. It's about a granddad passing on his nuts. It? Yes! <laughs> it is! It's so full circle. That's Again, a Austrian movie, yes. It's an ongoing theme in the movie. Just like yes. the full circle thing. Mm -hmm. Like we were won wondering about the chicken skin. Then we find out that he got a s rare skin disease from the gypsy dancer. It's a backup story uh, in a background story. Yes. It's amazing. Yeah. It's yeah. multi-level storytelling. Like my mind was blown several times. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, tell us more. What, what, what else blew your mind? I mean, I... I, I, I particularly in uh, found uh, the, the, the first time he goes full A-team style and improves his weaponry and gears up oh, scene. Really the satisfying. Montage. Yeah, the montage. I mean, as an Austrian, I'm apparently trained to love the montage. There's nothing apparently I, in my DNA that can resist it. But still, that was a pretty sweet montage. That's because it's the most efficient use of camera time. <laughs> <laughs> It has to be done exactly this way, not a second wasted. There was not a second wasted in the entire movie. Like, oh, I need a director's yeah. cut. <laughs> There's oh. a director's cut, actually. Oh, <laughs> mm, sliding off my chair. <laughs> You're already sitting in a pool of yourself? Or <laughs> <laughs> I mean... For when it comes to gross out moments, this this had also some really good moments when it comes to that. I mean, the guy who was split in half and was just chilling yes. against the wall was looking amazing. Like and the head, the, the head that was decapitated and yeah. it was still like, it, it pulsed like two times, like the yeah. bleh, bleh. the attention to detail yes. in this movie. Oh yeah. my God. Really good, and like the like how the hairs flew when the head was thrown across the blue sky. Uh huh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Contrasting m m the freedom of the mind against mm -hmm. the. Uh, oh my God. The reality of Earth that brings you down and mm. kills you eventually. That movie yeah, is it's so it's deep. It yes. cuts deep with the snow shovel. Yes. It's amazing. Yeah. No. The, the, the I think I think it was it was very nicely done how it is in the title and then only used at the end, but then <gasps> full out snow, snow shovel action, <laughs> you know, not holding back with the snow shovel. Yeah. That's, that's, I've, I was very anxious, like two thirds into the movie, that they would pull back on the snow shovel, mm -hmm. and then all mm -hmm. of a sudden he mm -hmm. has like mm -hmm. Edward shovel hands, and he has just... It was all the shovel action. Yes, yeah, it, we, we got our sweet deal I of shovel action. I like the creative... It was Herman and the snow shovel, like, uh, there's yeah, no... Yeah, but there are movies... And you got Herman well, and yes. the snow shovel. Exactly, yeah. Sometimes Sometimes a title tries to pull you in with, with, with. I feel like you're giving this film more creative <laughs> license than it maybe deserves. <laughs> it deserves all the creative. I think license. I think we should write some 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 fan fiction for this. Oh my god! Yes. Yes. Go Herman. Yeah, about the about the grandmother, how she banged somebody the last it forty years because granddad wasn't there. It needs more backstory. Also, the, also where Herman's. Parents. There's you know. so many questions. Yes, exactly. All we can do an, a limited run comic graphic novel, maybe. I know all the backstories of all the villains. Like yes. I was fascinated. I mean, I mean, they they are pretty much except for the boss who got his flashback scene. Mm -hmm. I think the rest of them were very self-explanatory in th what yeah, they the did. The characterization was amazing in that movie. Yeah, I mean, the Euro trash fighter at <gasps> the end was. <gasps> Euro trash dancer that walking That orange guy. shirt. Oh, amazing. It was perfect. Um, he, he, he embodied everything I mm -hmm. hate about uh, Europe. Really, in, <gasps> it, they, they really molded him into one person. I'm like, that was ooh, so I want to kill him dude. too. Oh my God. <laughs> I loved the flamboyant village vandalism. Like, <laughs> I lo oh, yeah, oh. that guy was on mm. fleek. I yeah, I love how like, they <laughs> <laughs> uh, when dad tries to Just be cool. A long groan. Is this what the kids say? Hashtag mood. No, that movie was such a mood. Uh huh. Like uh, I loved like the idea of countryside and like yes. how uniquely it interacts with the Front human row, experience. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> yes, guys on the cheap mm. seats. Well, <laughs> technically they are all cheap seats because they're free, but. <laughs> anyway, 
anyways, uh, my yes. uh, my best moment would be each individual kill scene that was so masterfully done. Uh-huh. Like the attention to detail is just mind blowing. I mean, I think also cool that there's a there's a nice. Uh, symbolism thing going on at the end that the rapist is getting pierced by like a hard wooden staff. Yes. Again, right? I think you're giving them way more <laughs> credit than they. <laughs> no, no, no. I think I think that was it's that was there. intentional. No, you don't think so? No. I <laughs> saw it more as exploring the creative murder potential of the shovel. Ah, okay. Yes. That was before expressed in the character growth of Herman. Like mm-hmm. you saw him sharpening the shovel right, and like right. hoisting the shovel on his back before he went on his motorbike ride, and then his grandmother yelling "Herman!" and just <laughs> something within our hero just breaks, yes. and he transforms. Mm-hmm. He trans he turns into the shovel. Ah, like the instrument. <laughs> the instrument is. You are the instrument at yes. the end. Yes. Yes. Yeah. He was the tool the entire time. Uh, and then he was abducted. I mean, he was a big tool <laughs> the whole way through, let's be yes. honest. Yes. He was a tool that became independent and aware <laughs> of his self-aware tool-ness. tool. This movie was extremely self-aware. You know uh-huh. how movies like, this is going to be so epic. And no, like, this movie knows what it's doing. Oh, yeah. This movie yeah, knows yeah, no, it's no, no. silly. You feel that in every step. It, you feel I that in oh every step of I the... I love how it embraces the human awkwardness, just like the cat, like... Who knows how to call the cat? A cat doesn't want to be held. Yes. They they just <laughs> yes, that cat was moving around quite a lot. Like that was mm. a fidgeting pussy if I've ever seen one. Oh I know, they had the m- They already had the stunt cat. Why didn't they <laughs> just give him the stunt cat for I think scene? that wasn't a stunt cat. I think that was just a little bit of felt I on the floor on the floor. Yeah. <laughs> it was somebody's it song. It did not look like a cat. <laughs> it sounded like a cat. The sound editing in this movie? Oh my god. Yes. Like no, when th- he again. hit the shovel like a yes. shield and like it resonated across the room. I was shook. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I have tried so hard to impress you. <laughs> Delivered so so half of the result compared <laughs> to this film. <laughs> Did do you get even a smidgen of this in the bedroom? As compliments. He bangs me harder than that shovel was banged. <laughs> <laughs> wow. There have been nice. no complaints. Nice. Uh, well done, man. In that case. Woo. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, so and uh, like. If you had to pick one mm. moment, what 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 was the standout moment for you? I what? personally really connected with the first murder because yes. I think it has the most sh- shock fa- factor. Also, that guy who decided to stab the chestnut stand. With <laughs> <laughs> oh, he was enthusiastic. With a pocket knife. Yes. Like, yeah, oh. it. What, it. Was, what was his name? Rocco? No, no, it Eva. was... What? Cleaver, Cleaver yes. It. What a brilliant name for a knife villain. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I mean, let's be honest. Not someone who clearly knows how to use a knife. Of <laughs> <laughs> uh, it got lost in translation. Lost in translation a little uh, bit. Okay. Re- was it the subtitles that made that stabbing <laughs> stupid, was it? <laughs> <laughs> like, without the, without the subtitles, it's the fucking Maroni stand there bleeding to death going, please, no. <laughs> Let me speak to my wife before I mean, I the go. Maroni stand himself could have gotten an Oscar, let's be honest. <laughs> uh, like, the f- tumbling down scene of the Maroni stand was, <sighs> like, such powerful stuff that... It was, it was, I think it was a, a, a message about the yes. collapse of the uh, USSR in the 1980s, you know? You know? Death. Yes, de- definitely, because it's cold outside and there was a rickety building, which is the USSR, and there's a little bit of food inside, but not really. Oh and my all God. collapses because somebody kicks over the oven. And yeah, Did mo- that's, this that's movie tackles the real issues fell. of society. Again. <laughs> I feel like you're giving this more <laughs> credit than it deserves. Didn't we watch the same movie? No, apparently not. <laughs> apparently we watched a way, way different movie while Jack was in, in, in Strokeland, apparently. Yeah, Jack, we get it. We're from Europe, unlike you. <laughs> yeah. England is still part of Europe. I'm so sick of having to have this I like how you use the word still. Like Geographically, I'm not. I'm surprised we made it this long. <laughs> Uh, you guys are just fucking bitter because we didn't lose as much territory as you guys did. <laughs> what? 
Well, like, border-wise, you lost. Oh, you guys lost. Yeah. okay. I'm not on stage yet. <laughs> <laughs> yes. If the Scotland referendum had gotten through, you would have. But, oh. but right, it third. didn't. Yes, by a smidgen. All right. All right. I mean, I, mean, no, I think... Back to the arteries. I really enjoyed the blood spills. Yes. The, like, do you feel like they were a little bit too much, but they were like just the perfect amount? I, it's, it is a bit splattery. And the yes. ketchup blood. Oh. Uh -huh. Like the curry I actually, blood. Actually, I enjoyed the wine blood more. It, it's more of an Austrian message. <laughs> like if you stab an Austrian, he's just going to spill wine out of his mouth. <laughs> it seems like a natural thing well, to do. We've got a question. Yes. I want to congratulate you on your stunning use of the English language. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> hey, <Have> Samuel. <laughs> Answer the question. I don't, know, I don't know if you're drunk, stupid, or Austrian. I'm going to give you five. I'm going to give you five minutes to think about that question again, and then you can speak to me. Yes. Answer his question. It seems about right. All right, let's introduce our last co-host of the night to the stage. You didn't answer. Uh, yes. It wasn't a question. <laughs> but we, we have to wait a second because the camera broke down. What? <laughs> what happened? Um, it's okay, I'll fill in the silence. Just look at the <laughs> Really? It already ran out. Jesus Christ. I'm going to perform you, you a, you a performative you dance. Do you need help? <laughs> All right, you two guys take over for a while. What? Hello. Wait, where the fuck are you going? He's going to fix the technical issue. Oh, he has to stall and improvise. Oh my god, he has a controller. It looks like an Xbox controller. I think that's what it is. I'm going to fuck so around with That's so cool. No! Shit. Jack, no, no, you're not good with technology. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck with it more. Fuck with it more. No, no, don't. Whatever your name is. So, what was your favorite part about the movie, Jack? Ah, uh, the, the ending sub, the ending scene. <gasps> oh yeah, the juggling dancer. No, no, I mean the ad credits. Look, this movie. What, what was it? The the. The old shoe film production. Dude, oh, yes. I feel like this encompasses the entire ideology of the movie. It just takes something that's considered trash and it makes it into art. That's, that's a beautiful point. That yes. dude dancing with three boobs. Uh huh. I mean, he it shook was, all three of those. It was immersive. Really nicely. It was an immersive experience. Yeah. It was For at no least a third more attractive than a normal dancing scene. At least. At least. At least. Yes. All right, now now we're ready. All right, now we're rolling. Okay, let's welcome him. Well, I butchered this really badly. All right, let's welcome him to the stage. He is the Grand Master of Vienna. It is Tomasz Vamos. <laughs> All right. Hello, man. everyone. Uh, yes. Welcome, Effendi. Yeah. What? <laughs> Effendi. Welcome, Effendi. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Uh, yes. So, so Jack. Tamash, Tamash. Uh, wait, 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 wait. Yes. Before you say anything, All there's right. one callback I'd like to make to the thing. Uh, I don't think the USSR collapsed because someone kicked an oven over. <laughs> and uh, you can't be sure though. Uh, yeah. Uh, do you want to? Yes. Break my whole job here. Or Paul made me do puns, and I apologize <laughs> in advance. It's uh, <laughs> it's a thing I have to do. You know, it's like you know. Uh, just, just go, go, yeah, go. Yeah. All right, go. all right, all right. Let's yeah. start the segment. Every day I'm shuffling. Oh my god. Plow, ah! <laughs> plow, plow, plow. Every day I'm shoveling. <laughs> what do you do with your off time? Do you let. 
<laughs> I, I choose to believe for the sake of everyone in this room that this was handled five minutes before you left your building to get here. Because if you sat down and planned this, there I is spent no two hope. hours on it. Oh my. <laughs> you spent two hours on every day I'm shoveling. Wait, 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 wait. No, did, no. you, did you spend two, two hours each or two hours total? Makes two a hours big total. Two hours total. Okay. Okay. That's, that's, that's still that's unacceptable. That's, that's, all, that's all right. That's all right. That's, that, that's, I guess that's, no, it's uh, not. It's I mean, impressive. I went through three different drafts of. <laughs> Plow, plow, plow. Of course okay, you listen, You're guys, Austrian. I don't think you get the gravity of what's about to happen, <laughs> but uh, <laughs> he made me do puns. Yes. That means he made me force something I'm not good or like like at all and <laughs> I no, you know how you I, I know I know what I have written and I just yeah. Yeah, go. Yeah. yeah. Please. Uh, hit us uh, with some some puns. Oh. First, set up set up the scene maybe or something. Yeah, that you, that you had to, to pun about, you know. Totally. So the movie <laughs> started with snow in the background. Uh, well, it didn't, but yeah, okay, gone. Yeah, it, it was totally snowing shit in the background. Yeah, it was. All right. it was on, I know you concentrate on the blood, but that's yeah. That's fine. Uh, so I thought that was a cool intro. Oh. Ew. <laughs> 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 no, nice. no, that's the thing. I think most of us get it. It's just bad. <laughs> yeah, like it's uh, no. <laughs> it's similar to a joke pool? without the yeah. laughter yeah, at the end. Yeah, if somebody doesn't do it with a shit-eating grin at the same <laughs> time, it just doesn't work as well. <laughs> it's, it's, uh, no, I mean a difference between a joke and a pun. <laughs> <laughs> That's the only <laughs> difference between a joke and a pun. Also, I'm Hungarian. A shit-eating grin is something I do constantly. <laughs> it's, uh, oh, it's, it's just your normal food. That's how you eat. Thank you. I think that's all the Romanians clapping <laughs> in the audience. <laughs> it's, uh, no, 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 no. The Hungarian. I'm sorry, <laughs> Slovakians. Me Me Slovakia. uh, <laughs> Mexico is the Romania of America. It's funny. <laughs> <Yeah>. What? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yes, it is. That actually. is the best thing I've heard today. It is. <laughs> yeah, I mean, they, they, they pick a fruit. Okay, listen, can I yeah. just blast through this and then you can all take me out and, like, lynch me outside? Yeah. Because this, okay, so, uh, Herman is selling chestnuts and meets a girl who would like Herman to be her man. <laughs> and, hey I should have. I should have also put that's one also of those DJ that noises. This bam, bam, bam. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I totally would have needed a badum yeah, at yeah. the <laughs> end of all of them, just for I no mean, reason. I we can do a badum. Also, I have to point out, like he is selling chestnuts to the only Herman is yeah. selling chestnuts to the only person in the probably probably the whole village who would like him yeah. to not on her chest. <laughs> not sure. <laughs> not sure that qualifies as a pun. Like, <laughs> uh, well, the rose battle was a couple of weeks ago. <laughs> that was uh, yeah, I also like after this. I have to point out. Uh, I'm kind of like at this point. There was a. Uh, a basement rape scene in the movie. Yeah. I don't know what's with you Austrians and this shit, but... Uh, <laughs> We're working through some stuff, you know? <laughs> <laughs> it happens on the regular... What should we get the bad guys to do? I basement mean, rape. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah. And everyone kind of got behind that. Base rape. Like they would have gotten rapes. behind the girl. Oh my God, I feel so <laughs> sorry. Like, uh, yeah. You, you totally have all the right to lynch me after this. <laughs> uh, then uh, the next one I wrote was when uh, Hellman broke the neck of the guy, twisted it, which was kind of a twist for me. Uh, <laughs> 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 it's so much fun to see somebody else do it and hate it. It's so much fun. <laughs> It's so much fun. Is this how you constantly feel? Like, I just want to like... <laughs> oh, it's self-hatred all the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I also, like, after this, I have to point out, like, I saw Igor the Intolerant was the worst guy from the group. <laughs> that's also... Ivan. That's such an Austrian thing. Like, we have the rapist, the knifing guy, the uh, like, the chain dude. Yeah. But Igor the Intolerant. Yeah. Like, it was like, Ivan. No hate speech. Yes. I don't care. Like, you can rape in basements I and mean, knife people on the streets. 
no intolerance. I mean, though. that like gang was pretty woke. Let's be honest. Was they had a gay. They had two gay guys in there. Was Igor Austrian? Uh, no, Most he likely spoke not. Russian. Yeah. Oh, he, he did speak Russian. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> this he is not a Q&A. Yeah. No, he Just did not <laughs> speak <laughs> Russian. It sounded like a Czech person imitating a Russian accent, so Serbian maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Either that thanks, or Austrian thanks. dialect. That's, we don't that's know. That's why we it get foreigners here to, to have some background information. Thanks, Monica. Yeah, <laughs> uh, I, I, I really want to power through this and then just... <laughs> uh, uh, then one of the guy guys got electrocuted, which was really shocking to me. <laughs> <laughs> wait, 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 wait. <laughs> no, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> that was supposed to be really funny, but it wasn't. <laughs> it was, it's okay. Oh, did you try to do a <laughs> bum, 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 bum? No, I tried oh. to do a wah, 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 wah. Don't <laughs> clap that. <laughs> <laughs> They're clapping for the effort, not yes, the real yes, like that that effort. Effort. Yeah. effort. Like yeah. that, that's like you, you get a participation medal. I mean, yeah, like that, that's the thing about stand up, right? We all get paid for the effort. Like no one really like yeah. You're getting uh, paid? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh sorry, I just I'm the only Jew here, so yeah. yeah uh, we had to we we had to strike Oh yeah, you, hey, you get to stay in a country as opposed to Mexico. That's hey, that's totally a deal. Like I'm just saying. Uh, as a, so I'd like to come back to powering through the puns and uh, <laughs> yes, please. then one of the guys got stabbed by the Schneeschaufel <laughs> and that's uh, sticking to other weapons then <laughs> that, that, no, no. <laughs> no no don't get me wrong like yeah. I'm, not, I'm not like pausing here I'm just like I know that's the only reaction it's gonna get that's the best of it and I wanna <laughs> enjoy every second of it so <laughs> I just like yeah, it felt like a warm shower. A bit. Yeah, it's now uh, you know how you feel in my uh, how it yeah, feels in my skin. The warm shower the weight of your face. No, that was a cold shower. It was just, uh, <laughs> <laughs> holy <laughs> shit! Right. Like, wait, wait, right, is, he, is he one of your friends or do I get the shit on him? I'm not sure right <laughs> now. I'm not sure. He's shitting all over my show. I can't even tell who it is. Oh, it's the drunk guy sat down. And yes. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. By he, the way, by the way, before this recording, book. I went, I went to uh, shop to buy booze with Razvan, and we saw Brexit whiskey. <laughs> and, what? Uh, <laughs> that I, already exists. I'm not Brexit whiskey exists, and we just started making jokes like, yeah, they pretty much just use tragedies to sell alcohol. Yeah. So imagine if they used like the Holocaust <laughs> to sell whiskey. <laughs> And they could really say, like, you know, that ashy taste at the end. <laughs> <laughs> Not sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's real like burnt, real charcoal kind of. That, that charcoal yeah, yeah. thing. Like yeah, gives it I just one-upped your shit. You're welcome. It's just a flower flow. Gives it more of a... Um, I don't think there were any flowers, though. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> you don't think? No? I, d I, I wasn't there, obviously. Well, yeah. But <laughs> I... I <laughs> Yeah, I have one left. Uh, oh, yeah, please. The ending really alienated me. Oh. <laughs> 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 Woo! All okay, right. Okay, guys, guys, I don't like. So he here's the note. Uh, so, guys, just make one observation. <laughs> uh, yeah, you can make one observation. Is no one going to talk about how the chestnuts were literally chestnuts? Oh! Whoa! Nice. What the fuck? You're you're the pun guy. Yeah, I was sorry. forced to do this. No, actually, <laughs> I was paid to do this because I'm Jewish. <laughs> I can strike a better deal than any one of you. But I was. <laughs> how did you not come up with that shit? Like, yeah, I sorry. Know. Yeah, I I fumbled that hard. Okay, first yeah, of sorry. all, like we. We were sitting there with Paul when the movie started, and like five minutes in the movie, I noticed Paul hasn't even seen this movie. <laughs> like, uh, I saw some of it. Before I didn't want to completely poison my mind prior to the whole thing. So you poisoned yes. all of ours instead. Yes, that was the. That, that was, was great. The I, I <laughs> thought that was fantastic. But I mean, I, I mean, I enjoyed it. The like poisoning. At this point, I would so love if the secret guest was the actual director of the movie. <laughs> yes. I'm kind of hoping the secret guest is a I drunk guy the sat down on his ass like a child. <laughs> <laughs> No, 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 stay where you are. See, so yeah, 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 that was not. What, what, what we are going to do is, is, is moving on, and that's to the. That was in no way a call to action. <laughs>
So, yes, because what is wrong with Herman? Has he, he Tourette's? He's, in, he's inbred. Jack he's made that clear. Like inbred. Just inbred? I think, I think that's why his parents aren't around. Oh. <laughs> Maybe he's just Austrian. They're just locked up. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, again, yes, <laughs> that's, a, that's, a, that's, 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 that's always... That's like the biggest applause anyone's ever gotten the whole night. And I think <laughs> since we're in Austria, that's brave. <laughs> I just like to point that out. That's not nice of any of you. I think there is nothing wrong with Herman. I think it's a yeah. spiritual journey of mm. a young man yes. discovering that the real His nuts are yeah. not on the outside. It's yes. about the nuts that are within you. Ah. That is when he is taken, um, when the chestnuts get taken away from him, mm -hmm. he discovers his inner power, which yes. is like this burning, hot desire for yes. the woman and also uh -huh. the liquid. It's symbolized in you the are coming and of and age. Yes. yes, you are without a doubt story. the best part of this podcast. <laughs> <laughs> like it just, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I mean, I, I mean, I got movie. two of the most negative guys I had <laughs> ever in in on the podcast with the most positive one, just to see, just to balance it out a little bit, you know. Perfect. That's yeah. I think that's spectacular. Exactly. I. I also thought it was going to be one of those the nuts were inside you the whole time kind yes! of stuff. <laughs> and it was just a regular chest of chestnuts uh -huh. found in the Middle East and shit back to him. Yeah. But then he fed it to her after the bullet wound and it completely healed. It was like, oh no, they yeah. were magic nuts. But she had but to like, put, really I mean, put a spirit also, into it. I mean, is it, is it also th uh, the, 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 the moral of the story here is really bad if you want to show it to your kids because... I don't. I, mean, I, I mean, really don't. I mean, it, it means that doping is good because that are those are some performance-enhancing nuts that he has. Yeah, that was just and the Russian he, and sponsors and he, insisting on. And he just on eats putting. more and more as the fight continues, <laughs> and he 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 definitely uh, yeah, I think overnutted a bit there at the end and that's why he's puns tripping. work better when I do them bro. Yeah, like yeah, it's just I don't it's incredible I don't I know think, why but it's just who sit in the corner for five minutes <laughs> and think about what you've he done he is sitting in the corner <laughs> I'm already in the corner this, yes. this looks like detention from a distance like if you just mute the video it probably looks like just all of us shitting on him <laughs> and he has, a, he has a mic for no reason as and actually opposed to if you unmute the video <laughs> <laughs> No, I meant right. even if you mute the video. Yeah. Good point. So so just inbred. Exactly. Your That's my it's a coming of age story about the nuts that are inside. And you're inbred too? Well, no, I don't think well, like I think I think that's what we all looked like when we were sixteen. It's just yep. a thing yes, that we I go look through. It's very so relatable. Yeah, I, I, I really huh? I th well, he was supposed to be really young. Oh, I mean, okay. the actor is like twenty seven. With his grandmother and sh she hazes him for not having a real job. Yeah, so, but I mean, my he got a, he's like Charlie I'm, Brown. He's I'm like Austin Charlie and Brown. My grandma hazes me for not having a real job. <laughs> so. my, my how does she haze you? My, like my mom, Jew <laughs> my, my Jewish mom, still do, does that, and I do have a job. So it's like, oh, okay, uh, yeah. Weird, yeah. Uh, I'm not gonna tell you where I'm from. Right. Mate, I will buy and sell your ass right now for sport. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Me too. <laughs> <laughs> I'll do the He's Thanks, man. Told off by an audience member. Yes, classic. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what I always wanted in a first <laughs> live <laughs> recording of my podcast is a very consistent heckler who is also very drunk. It's it was it makes you know it completes the package. Yeah. I think. Yes. So let's 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 move on to to the second to last. Touch it. All right. <laughs> Final conclusion. This movie was bad. <laughs> <laughs> Even for a comedy, I thought it was just a low-budget horror movie. It was straight-up comedy. It was a bad straight-up comedy. No, I, yeah. I, I, I enjoyed it. In reality, <laughs> I mean, I just, You're like, just too afraid that... The, that the I, can't, I can't let my emotions show at this point. Okay. <laughs> I, I will let my emotions show at this point, and I will let everybody see them. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I 
could you please pull this really Gladly. hard? Gladly. <laughs> <laughs> I've been waiting four years. You know, you, you know, you, that would be the second time that d you destroyed uh, Grint property. <laughs> It, yeah, I, guess it was. <laughs> I am not green property, you dickhead. No, the cable, <laughs> you ass. <laughs> it's I wasn't that's concerned what you're concerned about, about you, man. <laughs> Stupid. I know. Uh, Austrians, Austrians about, are yeah, usually yeah. not concerned about Jews. See? Yeah, but we're just. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I like the movie. I like the movie. <laughs> Make up your mind. It, it, it Make up your mind. Come on. It totally knew. It was super self-aware. Yes. It knew what it was doing. I, again, at the, the moment I really Jack, think Jack, you want to cut in? <laughs> you want to cut in with the thing you said seven times at this point? You want to cut in be <laughs> before he goes on with uh, giving more credit to the movie? Like the thing with... No, the no, he was on point. Like when he's com comparing it to the fool of the USSR, <laughs> then I'm like, yeah, maybe you're overanalyzing a bit. Yes. But when you're just staring, it was a dumb movie. It's yeah. Like, yeah, I'm fine no, with that. I, it, it, for example, like the, the moment that really, really... I, I already talked about this, but the, the moment that really put it over the edge for me into good territory was the moment where the fat, the fat gay guy was whipping the chain and it actually did the <laughs> sound. Yeah, and the I'm like, sound yes, effect. Yes, thank you. This is somebody at the sound engineer's side was like, I have to put that in There's there. There's so much attention it, it, to detail in yes. this movie. I love it. It yes. reminds me of Beyonce's visual album, The Lemonade. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Actually, uh -huh. as you yes. said, it, it reminds me of Beyonce's song called Flawless. Because <laughs> this Almost. movie has been flawless. No, let me finish my point. Yes. My please. point. As my point, my lady. You know, when he has the chestnuts stand, mm -hmm. it's like setting up a lemonade stand. Yes. Like that's where I got that. Oh my God, this is what this movie is all about. You get something in life and you turn it into something beautiful that fills your mm. heart with Serial joy. Serial murder. Does this mean that hey, she's from Slovakia? Okay. Does this Give mean that Jay-Z cheated on the director of this movie as well? Yeah, Jay Z totally financed <laughs> it by dropping some coins, and <laughs> which was then the budget. And what I meant yeah. by this is like it takes nothing and like it's like no budget, mm -hmm. maybe like th thirty yes. euro budget, and it uses it. I think it was a with bit more than that, finesse but, yeah. and style and panache. Uh huh. And it uses it, it masterfully, and I really liked it. Yes. <laughs> no, I, I, again, I, I, I. I've I can wholeheartedly recommend this movie. Like, yeah, I would. I'd watch like, it again. Yeah, I would. I, I, I would, would totally watch it again. I would wholeheartedly recommend this movie to anyone with like very advanced Down syndrome. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, it's just a Something thing. Something they can aspire to. They're like, oh, that helmet yeah. seems very, or, very well adjusted. Or I would like use it in Switzerland for patients who, who want to do euthanasia. <laughs> it also <laughs> helps that a lot. Or I think. Uh, <laughs> What? I mean, just because you're introducing the idea of low budget to someone from Switzerland. <laughs> <laughs> Finally, someone who gets me. They didn't spend francs on this? Oh, my God. Uh, also, if you're on an airplane and the captain already knows you're going to crash, you can just play this movie to everyone and they would kind of be, be fine with it. So <laughs> these are the three scenarios. Well, this movie is the best. <laughs> it's just... Uh, yeah, I mean, I think we have we have we have we can we can we can do it all over the all over the board. Yeah. So um, I think um, we can we can slowly go towards the end of the tunnel of the light of this show, and uh, I'm gonna invite not one, not two, but three guys. Right? You're three right now, or did you multiply? No, oh, okay, good. That yes. W the three guys on stage, They're big not Chinese applause, uh, big, big applause of applause. No, that doesn't work. Big round of applause. Oh, thank you. Yes. <laughs> you speak. For the three guys who made this movie, <laughs> <laughs> it's Dominic M. Singer, Albert Krivanich and Reinhard Schröder. Woo! Oh, yeah. Sorry, you guys have to oh. give away your mics. 
No, no, no. You, you I was think. so expecting this just to happen. Just, I, I, just stand behind I, them. I can't believe that you guys didn't have something else to do oh this night with your fucking <laughs> movie making career. Uh, doubling down. Oh, how could you uh, afford this? Yeah. <laughs> I am you know, fangirling so hard. Yeah. So, uh, thank you very much. Yes. Uh, before you. you guys say anything, what drugs do you guys take? Because I really <laughs> keep taking them. If you have any more, oh I'd love much. some. Me personally. Yeah. Lots and lots and lots of drugs. Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah. Makes sense. Makes sense. <laughs> and for the rest of you, none. Well, love is all I need. Ah, that, that, that's a real drug of life. Okay. Um, yeah, thank you guys for being here. Thank you for, for letting me show the, m the movie. And uh, just why uh, did Hannah laugh when she licked your face? What was the taste? What was on your face? Because in the final kissing scene, there's like two oh, frames. There, oh, there, there, there are yeah. two frames. There are two frames where she's like snickering. Like, <laughs> what's, yeah. what's on your face, I man? I feel so bad for calling you uh, retarded. I don't know exactly. <laughs> 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 hmm. Do you remember what's on your face? Um, no. <laughs> <laughs> I think. I think she was very uncomfortable. <laughs> 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 of course. She yes. Was. I mean, yeah. was that did you did you shoot in order like was did you ha did she have to hype herself up for the rape scenes or was that like one one shot like no no we're just uh, professionals you know. Oh yeah yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. Everything ah, is planned. Yes, yes. Okay. <laughs> that that makes way more sense. Yes. Um, yeah, thank you f guys for being here. F thank you for, 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 for any, anything you want to, to say to the people of FFP, the people who are seeing, seeing that outside no, of yeah, this. But, 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 but there's just a lolly for you. Oh. Good. <laughs> for the only sweet person on stage. Nice. Yes. You get nothing, the two of you. <laughs> nothing, I say. Okay. Yeah. Oh, there's actually more. Oh yeah! <laughs> Woo. Nice, thank you, man. All right, um, you have a new project coming up uh, soon. Yeah, it's called Vamp uh, Vampire Vienna, uh -huh. yes. and it's <laughs> Jake his, is so his excited. movie. This He's guy yeah. on the left, uh -huh. is, it's his movie. Yes. Oh, what the guy who looks like a vampire? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. He actually is a vampire. Awesome, awesome. No, you you should get somebody who knows his stuff about vampires to film a vampire movie. Yes, excellent. <laughs> the, the, the Romanian in the front row is so offended that you didn't ask her. I mean, come on. Is it even Romanian at this point anymore? Uh, yes. Uh, I don't think so. Um, Nobody needs to be offended right here. We are glad for this conversation and we hope uh, you enjoy this move. You, uh -huh. you watch it at home. Yes. And uh, this is a great podcast. Thank you very much for oh, this. Oh, thank you guys. Yes. And uh, it, was, it was really uh, insightful, if I may uh, say so, yes. for all this. Uh, we haven't noticed all these uh, nuances and the little, <laughs> little. Uh, the new thing. double meaning. The double yeah. meaning. And, uh, but it's absolutely great. But you were also right about the, the, the weird uh, uh, pervert stuff and uh, <laughs> ne negative. It's all, I, I in there. it's all in there and you have to watch it for yourself. Uh, uh -huh. yeah. I would just like to say before that it's, it's really uh, comforting for me to know which three guys I'm going to get lynched by after this. <laughs> so uh, <laughs> yeah. Finally. Uh, I'm, I'm a little hate. bit unnerved that the quiet one's just been standing behind me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's watching. Lingering. A I don't know. Will there be another roast, or is uh, so no, we no, cool? I think, I think we're right now, coming, coming from an Austrian guy, I do not want to take part in that roast. So uh, <laughs> we have a big seller, you know. <laughs> what? Oh, you just made it serious. <laughs> uh, <laughs> okay. um, so I think I think we're con going to our last bit, and that's plugs. Plugs, guys. Where can people find you? Where, what do you have coming up? This is going to be released like n in 10 days or something like that? Um, I'm not sure, but you can find plugs in the ass. Oh, yes, yeah. yes, yes, yes. Those are my favorite plugs. Yeah. Butt plugs! <laughs> Finally, somebody who pulled out some real plugs here, guys. Right. <laughs> I, I actually have something to plug this time. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be doing my solo share 
my, yeah, my, <laughs> solo, solo, my show. solo show here on March 6th in this room. So, Woo! Yeah. Yes, guys, get excited. Jack home! Relentless. Yeah. Yeah. All right, you too. Uh, I have a show in Bratislava. I know it's a different country, but it's only 40 minutes away <laughs> from here. You uh, can something walk we used there. to own. You can take a metro and then walk a little bit. It's uh, the 9th of February. Mm -hmm. And I'll be shaking my tits a lot, and there will be Skittles. Yes! Woo! Yeah, right on. Yes, and you, my friend, my, Tamash. My, I, I, I do the Jew Slim show, which is when a Jew and a Muslim join forces to make you laugh. And uh, my... S <laughs> <laughs> See? Yeah. And... Uh, it's working. And already. I also do my solo show called Fucking Immigrant. And just, yeah, I like my page on Facebook called Tamash Vamash Comedy. It's, it's great. It's fantastic. It's amazing. And thank you for being here. Yes, thank you guys for being here. Thank you for the first live episode of FFPÖ. Thank you guys for being part of this experiment. I think it was great. I'm about to get my head fucking beaten in. <laughs> so uh, if you would like to meet me outside, yes. that would be great. Yes, please <laughs> take this outside. Let's get drunk, guys. Woo! <laughs> Thank you very much. Oh. Uh, yes, and we will show the trailer now. So stick around for a little bit. Yay.